Piece of crap. Let's do the donut chip. Poking out. Okay, so I'm going to be putting spacers on my car. I got these online. I'm going to be putting the link down below. They're 15 millimeter. Um, they are hub centric, 5x20, and they have the 72.56 hub. So they will fit basically perfect on these rims. Also, remember when you're getting spacers, you do get anti-seize and you also get the extended lug nuts. These are nice little black color. But make sure you get the extended lugs because uh, that's very dangerous if you don't. And then here's what they look like right now. These front rims are a eight and a half with a 35 millimeter offset. So once I put these 15 millimeter spacers on, it'll, it'll be, it'll bring it down to a 20 millimeter offset. So put these bad boys on. And the reason why you want to use the anti-seize is because you don't want this thing to you know, seize onto your hub. That happened with some spacers I had before and it was terrible trying to get them off. So this really helps when you want to take them off or change things around. All right, so I got the wheel off. Now apply some of the anti-seize right around here. You said what about plies? I'm gonna put this thing on. All right. <laughs> Nothing is private here. Nothing. Everyone knows. Funny how they came out, then went back inside. Oh, I was doing this during YouTube, but go back inside. <laughs> we don't want to be scared. Bro, now you look like those bully dog trucks. Fitness, fitness, fitness. I mean, it looks, it looks really good. That is, uh, it's kind of poking out a little bit. Yeah. Looks good. Is the next video when you camber it? it <laughs> I mean, you can tell on the video it's slightly cambered, like just enough. You can watch it later and see. Yeah. <laughs> So here's the difference. Here's this side. And then this side. You know, it's always something. I'm jacking my car up and the jack breaks. This whole little mechanism right there, this basically fell apart and it broke. I'm gonna try to put it back together. But I guess that's what you get for getting a Harbor Freight uh, jack. Piece of crap. So I fixed it. For the time being, piece of crap. It worked because I got my spacer on. So it looks great. And now to go for a test drive. No, does it make it lower? <laughs> does it feel wider? The kind of. So first drive on the spacer. So they don't rub, and they're not falling off. You ain't rubbing, you ain't dubbing. <laughs> no crazy shakes. I think they uh, they passed the test. Agreed. Now let's do the let's do the donut chip test. No, no donut. No, no donut chest. Chest. This is this is the real. Wow, that doesn't rub. That's a full lock too. Oh shit! Almost hit someone. Two forty. All right, so fifteen millimeter spacers on full lock. Don't even rub. So that's great.